how you live in this building right here? Do you need some groceries? Can you use some groceries? I sure can. Yeah. No, get you some. I'm Edgar, my wife Diana, and my daughter Vivian. Good to meet you. We're Kingdom First Missions. Well, but I have nothing done to it, and I'm out of work. I worked in coal mines for 12 years and can't buy a job. But uh, it's just real run down, and it ain't, it's not insulated. I've lived all my life, and it's boards like this. I don't even have a frame in it. Oh. It was never framed up. It was, uh, it was an old company mine uh, store in the top of it uh -huh. for a pony mines that used to run right up here on the, on the side of the mountain right here. And Joe Canillas owned it, old man named Joe Canillas, and uh, they they used ponies to pull cars out there, and they hand-picked the coal out of that mines right there, and then they'd load it in coal trucks and take it out of there. And he ran a little company store out of there, everybody that worked for him had to buy groceries off of him with script. What they called script. Yeah, we know script. And that was the store right there, and now, like I said, I was raised up there, and then when I was about nine, we moved about her age. I moved down. How old are you? Ten. Uh -huh. yeah. That's what I say. I was about her age, and we moved down there, and I've lived down my life. But would you Would you let us take a picture of the sure. place you live? Yeah. yeah. Can we walk over there? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. This is how you go up there up to your house. This is your oh, yeah, for right now. <laughs> or the ladder. Or you you go up like this with this or what? No, I go up on top. He does sometimes. He does sometimes. This. Up top. When he feels tired. Oh. Yeah, I go up there and sightsee or whatever. I go up there and watch the birds or whatever. Well, then we can. Do you wanna? Yeah. Thank you so much. You're welcome. He's telling me that this is not this is not their property, but he has a piece of land over there. Maybe we can build something over there on his land. If I just had a little two room building up there on my land, because this is not his property. Be this is not really we come and build something, and the guy who owns this property might take it away from we him. We lived in that house there, and somebody burned it while we was moved away. And then when we got out of the place, thing came back. It was gone. That place over there. I own a piece of land up on a hill, like I said, and there's a road that goes up to it uh -huh. so that you can get numbers up to it. And if I had a two room store, a two room building up there, it was just more like a home, you know. Yeah. I pray to God all the time I read my Bible. So well, now that you got in that subject, do you guys, how do you walk with the Lord? Are you saved? If you that? I am saved. Okay. I'm baptized and saved. Yeah. Are you married? Okay. Go to church, yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's good. Okay. We got married a year before we had our daughter. Praise God. You guys are not poor. Poor is that one who don't have Christ. Donald Trump has billions and billions of dollars, but that man is on his way to hell. You know, and you guys are rich because you have eternal. You have eternal salvation. That makes you rich. That makes you rich. We're just passing by in this land right here. You know, this is just a, a temporary stage, and we will help you guys. We will help you with whatever we can.
Oh, no. <laughs> they do, how do you guys cook? Well, there's side. Can I go up here? Go in there, look. Where is that? Like I said, it's built like a bottom shelter inside. Yeah. So you don't have any leaks? No. No leaks? No, this this ain't leaking. Like I said, it just ain't really mine. And I don't know. I'm living on borrowed time. I don't know how long I'll be able to. You want to see it too? You want to see it too?